Welcome to Brayon Math. To ask to solve this problem, we have a square, and inside the square are two uh, smaller right triangles, a green and a yellow one, and these two triangles are actually similar because they are derived from a larger right triangle with a total of five square units, and the green is a part, which is one square unit, and this yellow is a part of that, which is four square units. And we are required to find the area of this blue region, which is uh, uh, not this green and not this yellow, which is a part of the square. Okay, so let have, let's have first a review of the area scale factor. So uh, the area scale factor is a relationship wherein the ratio of the areas of two similar polygons is equal to the square of the ratio of uh, the respective lengths of these two polygons okay so for example in this in our case we label this one unit triangle as a a sub one and this yellow as a sub two Okay, so their ratio, uh, area 1 over area 2 is equal to the square of the respective length. So if we pick the length, so for area 1, let's label this green as A and this yellow as B. So for A, area 1, the respective length is A. So we have A over the Respecting then for area 2, which is B, and we square that ratio. That is equal to the ratio of the areas of the uh, two similar polygons. In our case, two similar triangles. Okay, so for our first step uh, for the solution, we are going to use this area scale factor. So, uh, area 1 is actually equal to 1 all over area 2 which is equal to 4 equal to the uh, respective length so a over b squared and we can actually write this 1 over 4 as 1 square over 2 square equal to a over b square so we can actually write this uh, 1 square over 2 square as 1 half square is equal to A over B square. And if we get the square root of both sides, we have 1 half is equal to A over B. So by cross multiplying, we can say that 1 times B or B is equal to 2A. Okay, so we did get this or use the area scale factor because we want to get a relationship between the two sides. So this is earlier, this is A, and this length is B, the hypotenuse of the yellow. So by area scale factor, uh, this is actually 2A. So we just did that to get how, how uh, there. Uh, how much greater is this length, this length of the hypotenuse of the yellow to this green, the hypotenuse of the green. Okay, so our reason for using these two sides is because these are the legs of this combined right triangle. And these legs are actually closely related to the side of the square. So notice that if you remember by Pythagorean theorem, the these are if these are the legs of this right triangle, the combined yellow and the green, then it is the hypotenuse. Its hypotenuse is actually the side of the square. If you notice it. Okay. So next is we use the Pythagorean theorem, and as you can see, uh, this 
combined yellow and the green is actually a right triangle which has a leg, leg of A and 2A and the hypotenuse is also this hypotenuse is also the side of the square so let's, let's label that as S and as you can see if we square that S that becomes also the area of D square so uh, we have a square plus 2a square is equal to the square of the side of the square so it is the hypotenuse and at the same time that squared length is actually the area of the square so let us call that as a so simplifying the left side left hand side we have a square plus 4 a square so we have 5 a square is equal to a and actually we found the relationship between the length square uh, the squared length of a and the area of the uh, square Okay, so our next problem is we need to find the value of a square. Okay, so to find the value of a square is we just need to remember the formula for the area of the triangle. And we focus on the combined area of the green and the yellow triangle. So the combined area is actually equal to 5. It is equal to 1 half times the base. And let us choose as the base as a. And the uh, height as 2a okay so we simply cancel this 2 and 2 and we have a square is equal to if we multiply this we have a square is equal to 5 square units okay so now to find the area of this square which is a area is equal to 5 a square and we have the value of a square as 5 so 5 times 5 so we have the area of this whole square as 25 square units okay so now for the final step is as you can see it is now easy to find the area of the uh, blue region so the blue region is simply area of the blue so this is area sub b is simply the area of the square minus these two areas the area of the green and the yellow of course so we have uh, area a area of the square which is a minus area of the green we call that earlier as area one a sub one minus a sub 2 for the area of the yellow so we have area of the blue is equal to 25 minus a sub 1 so that is 1 minus 4 so simplifying we have area of the blue is equal to 20 square units and that is our answer Okay, so thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you like our solution and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.